potential prostate problems and two prostate problems could include benign prostatic hypertrophy or prostate enlargement that leads to difficulty urination and the other uh, topic or problem with the prostate is prostate cancer. Another men's health issue that potentially men as they age can experience is erectile dysfunction or inability to maintain an erection. Men will start to note a weakening of stream. Sometimes they have what we call hesitancy where it's hard to get the urine stream going. And after they finish urinating, sometimes they'll get a feeling that they're not completely emptying their bladder. We have effective treatments for prostate enlargement and difficulty urinating. Historically, the only option was surgical treatment or what's called a transurethral resection of the prostate. We have now developed medications that can effectively treat the prostate. Some men begin these medications, never require surgical treatment. Other men potentially in 20, 30 years will require treatment. It is de individual dependent. Some people have diminishing erectile function in their early 50s, some 60s, 70s, 80s. We've recently determined that sexual function or declining sexual function may be an early indicator of cardiovascular disease and recommend men that have early erectile dysfunction visit with their primary physician or a cardiologist to, dis to discuss their heart risk. Certain disease processes can affect erectile dysfunction, specifically heart disease, obesity, and diabetes. Also potential medicines such as high blood pressure medications, antidepressant medications can also affect erectile dysfunction. We first try to use medical therapy. We have three effective medications, Viagra, Levitra, and Cialis that men can take to help improve their erectile function. Occasionally we have men who do not respond to medical therapy. We have three other effective treatment options which can allow men to continue to have sexual function even if medications fail. In the urology office this is what we are trained to do. We are very comfortable discussing it. We make it a comfortable environment and, and would welcome any patient either by themselves or with their spouse to come in and discuss their concerns about their erectile function and find effective ways to, to restore or enrich that portion of their lives.